Well, unfortunately for Charlie Puppy, he just messed his money up. Or should I say, EFCC assisted Charlie Puppy in messing his money up. Being a musician, of course, is just to get paid. Enjoy your work and also get paid. In fact, wherever you are, if you are working currently, eh, wherever you are, the reason why you are working is to get paid. And Charlie Puppy is not getting paid. You know what happened recently? He was forced to cancel a show with Odumudu Black because of visa refusal. And they refused this visa because of his crime. EFCC arrested him a few months before he became a megastar. And they, and they arranged him, the pictures are there over internet fraud and that particular issue is making him lose a lot of bag when it comes to international performance according to him recently he said hey y'all unfortunately i've encountered some delay in getting my visa and i'm no longer able to join odumudu for the first few days date of the tour in new york city and boston I'm really sorry for um, for any conveniences. This may cost my fan not a uh, nevertheless, not the less. I hope you all have an amazing time at the show and shower and show Odumudu, shower Odumudu with love. I will catch up with you soon. Unfortunately, guys, Charlie Poppy wasn't able to go to that show. I will know the reason why. Because he was arrested by EFCC and arranged his pictures are everywhere over fraud. That is what made the US Embassy to deny his visa because of that crime alone. That crime. I'm not saying it's guilty. I'm not saying it's guilty, but all I'm saying is that. Wherever you are moving, eh, wherever you are moving to, just be watchful of your step you are taking because it might affect you. Of course, you don't see where Charlie Poppy for sing a lot of songs that kind of like encouraged Yao Yao Boy. And again, even when he tries to appeal, these people can indeed just play in a song. Maybe he's trying to defend himself and be like, I am not a Yahoo Yahoo boy. I've never supported anything like Yahoo Yahoo. And if they carry one Charlie Poppy track, they plan for her. You will see where they support Yahoo Yahoo boys. So now you're going to tell the officer that, see, EFCC or EFCC arrested you then, back then, but now you are a changed person. You now advocate against Yahoo Yahoo. <laughs> person like Charlie Poppy go free advocate against Yahoo Yahoo. Yahoo Yahoo. Don't you think Charlie Poppy is afraid to advocate against Yao Yao? Mainly for the fact that, according to him, he feels like most of those Yao Yao boys are the one patronizing them. <laughs> well, unfortunately, Charlie Poppy, your bad record just dragged you down. You are missing that bag because of your bad record about Yao Yao. Come on, man. It's quite unfortunate. I feel bad for him. I really, really feel bad for him. But I don't know how it's going to be this case. Because, unfortunately, most of your song, you encourage the business, Yahoo Yahoo. So even if you are trying to defend yourself against the U.S. Embassy officer, they're going to tell you, how have you discouraged Yahoo Yahoo in your system in Nigeria? And then you, but you will start by saying, okay, I preach against it. But, but meanwhile, your music clearly states that you approve of it. But then again, we get a lot of politicians who are looting our funds and still get away with it. They still go to the U.S. Embassy and their visa is stamped well. Bam! So please, eh, allow Charlie Poppy to perform. He made few mistakes as a then. But now, Charlie Poppy thought, say, music money be like blood money. So I don't see what he will ever make Charlie Poppy go back to Yahoo Yahoo. And because of that alone, eh, 
I think the U.S. Embassy to, to reconsider and immediately issue him a visa because of that alone. And the EFCC also should also assist now. Well, I wish him all the best. I wish him all the best. But that Yahoo Yahoo, uh, that EFCC picture, uh, Charlie need to find a way to delete, to make EFCC delete that picture from their wall and also delete it from the internet. I think he should reach out to Tiwa Savage Aka so that Tiwa Savage Aka can assist him to delete all those things from the internet. <laughs> Which would I think that? Just reach out to Tiwa Savage uh, Aka's. After all, they were able to delete all Tiwa Savage tape from the internet according to them. But, it, well, let us move past that, guys. Uh, let's talk about Aria Star. Don't be surprised, eh? Hmm? I had a dream yesterday. I don't know why what Aria Star go fight for my dream. I had a dream yesterday that Aria Star won a Grammy. And I laughed. Don't be surprised. The next artist to bring home a Grammy will be a female musician from Nigeria. And it's either to me, sorry, it's either Thames or Aria Star. It's either Thames or Aria Star. I am rooting for to bring home the Grammy Award. Other terms or Aria Star. Those are the two incredible entertainers that I think we bring home the Grammy. But you know, we Nigerians, we are so focused on the boys, so focused on the top three, on the top four. And meanwhile, this girl, I, this girl Aria Star and Thames, they are doing extremely well. They are doing extremely well. In fact, Aria Star monthly view on Spotify is 20 million, even way than your biggest fab, even way that that person that called someone an influencer. Monthly view on that Spotify record is above 20 million. Do you know how it is hard to get 20 million views monthly? Extremely hard. Whiskey dials about 9.1. David do also have a 9 million. You see, it's extremely hard. To get it. That is why I feel that it's either Aria Star or Thames. Either Aria Star or Thames will bring them that award. So that's not all, guys, about Aria Star. Aria Star allowed Kia Sinet to hold her recently at, uh, at Nicki Minaj concert. Well, people are already making fun of J1. We're making money. We're making money. We're making money this year. We're making money this year. No matter what they say, we're making money this year. This year, this year, this year. Well, guys, J1, of course, you know the history between him and Aria Star. When he approached Aria Star to take pictures, Aria Star, oh, his hands. But meanwhile, all those BB guys, we are respected guys with money in the industry, most especially all those uh, America uh, influencers. They have free, free authority to who Arasta. And Arasta will hopefully and, and willingly oblige to them holding her. But the question is why did she hold? J1's hand. Why? She needs to tell us why. Is it that J1 is too be too small for you now? Come and tell us. Is this that you never knew it was J1? You just decided to take a picture with a fan? You never knew that fan was J1? Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. As long as you keep taking pictures of those people, eh? They will, they will surely drag J1. They will surely drag J1. Because J1 never had the opportunity to hold you. So, Arasta, 
Anytime you are back in Nigeria, just in case you are watching this video, I beg you, you need to uplift the dignity of J1. You need to uplift the dignity of J1 to remove himself from that name. Yeah? You need to uplift it, guys. So, guys, thank you very much for watching the boy, guys. I'm slaying. Catch you next time. Peace.